in this week's court report, a more than 40-day feud over access roads and easements involving Pahrump's most unlikely adverse party, Nye County Sheriff Sharon Worley, and a protective order application against her comes to an end for now after that TPO application is dismissed in justice court. The applicant of that TPO against Sheriff Worley is Gabriel Miranda, Worley's neighbor. At issue, Miranda filed the non-domestic violence TPO against Worley because he feels she was repeatedly accessing his property through an easement access road to get to her property. To further complicate the issue, authorities say Miranda cut down trees and used them to block and close the road. As part of Miranda's legal complaint, Worley was personally served with an application for order against stalking, aggravated stalking, or harassment on November 8th. Then on November 20th, there was a motion for continuance of hearing regarding order for protection received via mail. On the day the TPO hearing was originally set in court, it was continued. Then on the day of the hearing, which was Monday, the case was called by Judge Kent Jasperson. The court briefed the record regarding the TPO requested by Gabriel Miranda against Sharon Worley. Miranda's attorney, Tom Gibson, stated that his client will dismiss the application with the understanding that there is to be no adverse action by the respondent and motioned for an order or agreement on the record that Worley not use the easement access road on Miranda's real property until ownership of that section of property is decided in court. Then Worley's attorney, Brent Ryman, objected to his client being denied access to the easement road. Both Sharon Worley and Gabriel Miranda were sworn in and testified. Miranda provided a copy of the DA's report and one photograph as his evidence. After hearing testimony from both parties and argument from both attorneys, the court denied the application for order of protection. The court further ordered that the applicant restore the easement road to the original condition it was in before he cut trees and blocked access. That's to be done until a decision is made in a court of proper jurisdiction. So Miranda is to remove any blockage within five days from the date of Monday's hearing. That deadline to clear at least a temporary path for Worley is at the end of this week. This has been your court report. I'm Unette Gentry for News 25.